up uh, it's Raul from Conquest slash Dream Tea. Um, I posted up a video, uh, I posted up images today of uh, the new pop-up trolley system that I'm going to be using to display my army and transport uh, at the tournaments and I got a lot of requests for a video or details about this product so I decided to create this video. Um, it's not, you know, it's not going to be fancy but I'm going to try and get as much of it done as possible. So what is it? Well this is a trolley system. Um, the top is 24 inches wide, uh, 22 inches deep uh, and when it's popped up the trolley itself is uh, 36 inches high. Um, it is made of aluminum so all this is aluminum extrusion. Uh, the, the top is aluminum um, it has hex bolts that go right through it that secure the top to the frame. Um, uh, the top also has a laminate finish. You can have the laminate either on the white side or the black side. I have it more on the dark side here. Uh, I am getting a sheet metal plate uh, made uh, that will bolt right into these holes as well and that will make it magnetic so that I can put uh, magnets on my models and have them just sit on top here. Okay. Um, other than that, of course, it has stunning graphics. Uh, these graphics are interchangeable, so uh, you can put whatever image you'd like onto uh, the cart and really personalize it and customize it to uh, your army and your, your your specific needs. Now, these are removable, so um, you know they are velcroed on. Uh, this is uh, printed on stretchable fabric, so you can tension stretch it and then apply it to the velcro. Um, and they are reprintable so you can order just the graphics uh, by themselves uh, so when you buy the card system you just have to buy the graphics separately and you can keep on changing them around so what's cool about this well uh, obviously this um, trolley system has its own storage compartment uh, it is double zippered so you can see here so if you wanted you could you know, close it up and put a lock on it. Um, when we unzip it, uh, as you can see, there's two shelves. Uh, but the cool thing about this is this top shelf actually collapses. Um, there is two hard uh, shelving uh, flats uh, or, you know, two shelves inside uh, made of the same aluminum with the, uh, with the polycarbonate finish on it with an aluminum ridging. So, uh, if you pop that open, you can see that this shelf actually is zippered together. So when you unzip it, it actually folds away. And as you can see, I have an army transport case that is inside. Um, and this is, you know, a pretty decent, uh, you know, just a, you know, close to a travel case. Um, it pretty much fits all my models for my current army, for my flesh eater quartz army, also my war machine. Song of Ice and Fire, etc. It all fits in here. So, uh, yeah, the Army Transport case fits right inside. As you saw, uh, this is zippered. Uh, there's another flat piece at the bottom. These just give it structural support. Okay, uh, so once we remove that, uh, we're left with a nice big cavity that you can, you know, put a bigger case if you want it inside uh, and utilize it that way. So how does this thing fold down and how do you transport it? I'm just going to show you that quickly. So the first thing you want to do is remove the two inside flats. I'm just going to put them in the chair here. Um, second, you want to, you know, unvelcro your graphics. You don't want the graphics to get wrinkled and damaged. So you can fold them up and put them to the side. Uh, zip this up here. Move this back the panel. And like I said, this is all you know, stretchable, uh, very durable material, uh, very great finish to it. Uh, obviously, the colors are very vibrant, as you can tell from the video. Hopefully, you can tell from the video. And then so the great thing about this is this front graphic panel is a two foot by three foot approximate, um, you know, poster. So, you know, you can get some really cool, really 
big graphics on it and it looks kind of really awesome in my opinion uh, okay so we got all graphics off it's now bad bones as you can see uh, so how do we put this down into folding position so each one of these posts here is levered so when you hit that it folds um, pop this one it folds pop this one it folds pop this one it folds and now the system is ready to collapse so just press down on it and voila it's collapsed right so when it's in collapse position this width here is just under seven inches uh, obviously these these casters do come off so you can just take them off like that uh, they just screw off uh, so very portable uh, you and when you, I am traveling with it in my suitcase uh, because this fits in my large uh, uh, suitcase uh, I do pop the wheels off and have it travel inside the case so it does come in its own uh, pouch which looks like this uh, and basically all you have to do unzip it right. the cool thing about this is even with the wheels on it actually goes into the pouch it has holes cut out for the wheels so if you didn't want to remove your wheels and you wanted access to them uh, it actually fits right in Voila! Look at that! Awesome cart, cart system, ready for transport. I don't think you need that, and obviously. I mean, you can put your graphics and the extra boards inside, which I forgot to do right now, but you get the idea. And uh, that is my mini pop-up trolley system that I will be using for my army and that will be available from Dream Tea for pre-order. I will be posting a link shortly for that, but uh, hopefully this gives you all the specs that you need. Um, the total weight is uh, 20 pounds. so. Everything included is 20 pounds, so uh, that gives you an idea of weight. And the, the dimensions, once again, 24 by 22, when it's folded without the wheels on, obviously screw them off. It's 7 inches tall. When it pops up, it's 36 inches wide.